The Corn Refiners Association has just uh, made a proposal to change the name of their high fructose corn syrup to corn sugar. Oh, okay, well then, great. And they want to do this to clean up their image. They want people to uh, continue consuming high fructose corn syrup. Uh, please, Anna, corn sugar. <laughs> corn sugar. Okay. No, this is so funny. It turns out, and I think this is good news, it turns out that um, consumption of high fructose corn sugar is... See, they almost did it to you. <laughs> you went halfway. Yeah, the consumption of it has is down uh, the most that it's been in 20 years. Mm -hmm. Okay, so people are like, no, not buying it anymore. It's not good for us. We're not going to eat it. We're looking for some hardcore real sugar. <laughs> yes. You know, people are now in L.A. selling uh, Mexican Coca-Cola. Okay, and people are like, what? I, because what I it tastes so delicious, by the way. <laughs> no, you know why? Because uh, in Mexico, they, they were, on, but that changed recently, too. Right. They were putting sugar in their Coke instead of high fructose corn syrup. So people were like, get rid of that. Give me the one with the real sugar in it. So now, uh, this happened all across the country, actually. I mean, that's a funny little example, but Heinz Ketchup and then... And uh, Sara Lee. Sara Lee and a number of huge brands switched back to sugar, right? So the people who are making high fructose corn syrup are in a panic. Right. So what do you do in a panic? You don't have, of course, actually just a real problem. You do rebranding. You do better marketing. So now it's corn sugar, just like every other sugar. It's fine. But think about that for a second, okay? They know that people are reading labels now, and they're looking for high fructose corn syrup in the ingredients, all right? But now they won't be able to find it. They won't be able to find it. It'll say corn sugar, and then you have no idea that you're eating this highly processed corn product. Right, now they claim it's sugar just like any other sugar. You know, we'll leave that up to the scientists. And the it, FDA has not approved it yet. It'll take two years for them to approve it, so that when you look at the packaging, it'll say corn sugar. And will the FDA approve this? <laughs> come, on, come on, come on, come on, Like businesses don't run this country? Of course they will. And, uh, and, but right now in the marketing, they can immediately start calling it corn sugar. This is like when Blackwater changed its name. You know, they killed the 17 civilians in Iraq that, you know, in that one case we know of, they've killed a hell of a lot more than that in many other cases, et cetera, et cetera. But no, that was Blackwater. And by the way, what a name to pick for a mercenary <laughs> army. Blackwater. Blackwater. I mean, can you pick a worse name? Anyway, so they said, oh, yeah, our bad, our mistake. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we're going with a new name. Z. X-E. Okay. <laughs> so Blackwater, what name so? No, 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 we're Z. I like that idea, you know, because we run into trouble all the time on this show. Right, right? we do, we do. Okay, so if for, when I, next time I run into a controversy, I'm no longer Jen Cougar. I'm Q. Okay, I'll be Q and it'll be wiped, the slate will be wiped clean. I'll be like, who the hell is Jen Cougar? No, no, I'm Q, it's awesome. 